But Gaming Weekly welcomes you to the Friday brand, and we have some huge news at the top of this broadcast. Let's take it back to what happened this past week on Showdown. Richie D complained how Blame It On Hacks shouldn't be the Friday brand's manager just because he has been on a hiatus. According to the managers, they like the idea, and get this. Each week, starting today, there will be a guest manager to manage the Friday brand. When all guest managers have finished, you, the great fans, will have to vote. Who did the best job? Here at GameStop, I'm Adrian the Voice, alongside with KickMan545, MN5. And gentlemen, we have our guest manager right now. Please welcome Billy Ray. Yeehaw, Adrian the Voice. I reckon I'm guest managing this little show you got. And I'm a heck of a lot better now. Oh, great. Hacks, we fella. have another redneck. That's nice. What the hell's wrong with being a redneck? Just because well. you don't work hard enough to get a little sun on your skin. That's nice. That was good, by the way. Thank you, by the way. Oh, also, you know, joining us, we have a new manager, at least for tonight. So, Billy Ray, how is it? King of the Hill. How's it going? Oh, it's going pretty good. Hill how excited are so, uh, <laughs> I'm about to be, uh, Lost the lead. about to be your manager for tonight. Well, of course. Absolutely. I understand that you actually have two huge announcements. One will actually be oh, sent yeah, at the end um, of the broadcast. I'm going to... Oh, yeah, I'm going to get to that one later. But, um... <laughs> And I reckon tonight we'll be doing, uh, I like, I'd like to see a sword tournament, really. Finish yeah. it all off. Yeah, I remember last week there was a number one contender to face Soul Eater the champion. However, the number one contender is no longer because the guest manager, get this, is putting the sword tournament championship on the line. Look at Benny Gun Killer 10 now falling off. And already the game is over. It looks like nuclear RVSB with one point, ladies and gentlemen. The rules were very simple. You had to use the Warthog, push off the opponents. The winner with the most points will win. Well, nevertheless, though, it's interesting. It's interesting that you state that, of course. The Sword Tournament Championship will be on the line later on tonight. I just still cannot believe that we have another Redneck involved in this whole mess. Now, what the hell's wrong with being a Redneck? There's nothing wrong with it. It's just that, you know... Hey, the city is great, though. You gotta admit, we the had, city's great. It's just that we had, yeah, it's just we really had multiple people that talk in a more well, southern accent. Well, and ladies, that's the thing. we have multiple people. <laughs> well, so, not, yeah. By the way, I mean, you, it's a good accent. So. Wait, but you live in North Carolina, right? You love North Carolina. No, 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 no. You South don't like Carolina. Uh, South Carolina. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. It's just that Try. North Carolina is the better state of the of the two, but. True that. Hold up there. That's fine words right there. Why? Yeah. Just the better state of the two is my personal opinion. I mean, can you imagine all the rednecks being smart in South Carolina? This whole world would be, uh, well, it would be terrible. <laughs> but nonetheless, though, ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, it is Garbage Day on Trash Compactor Supreme. We want to thank everyone for joining us tonight. Of course, you just heard the news earlier. The guest manager is here with us. Billy Ray has joined us. And Billy, of course, you're none other than a proud, well, you're a proud redneck. Hey, you know, I actually was doing a, a little, little bit of research. Apparently, you actually want to be a cowboy, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, um, I'm uh, planning on moving out to Texas and uh, getting myself a little ranch out there. What are you going to What are you gonna be I doing with a ranch? Hey, you can, you can meet me. Well, I'm going to be growing cattle, really. Really? How the hell am I going to be a cowboy without cow? I'm sure you and are. I'm going to be copying the <laughs> demolition ranch on YouTube. <laughs> Well, ladies, I have no idea, but ladies and gentlemen, this is Trash Compactor Supreme. Let's talk about the rules here for a quick second here. You want to talk about owning? Our, our great fan, Yake and Mike One First Seven, just put every day is garbage day in, in South Carolina. Fiction. Nonetheless, though, here tonight <laughs> in this matchup, ladies no, and gentlemen. that's New Jersey you're thinking of. New Jersey? Yeah. Well, let's agree that the best state is Florida. Zombie. Nevertheless, though, it is Trash Compactor Supreme, folks. The rules are as follows. Oh. The infected zombie will indeed have the gravity hammer in hand. As you see already, early going, he took down three uh, players right now. The infected zombie will have the gravity hammer in hand. His job is to try to push off the vehicles. As you see, he's doing that right now. He's doing a pretty good job in the early going here. As the vehicles oh. fall, the garbage is beginning to fall down. Here tonight, ladies and gentlemen, the players will have to dodge the objects here tonight as nuclear gets infected. There you see the carcass is down and out. Yankee Mike 147 is standing at the left side of the map, and that's exactly what you want to try to do. Try to keep your day uh, isolated here tonight. And here tonight, ladies and gentlemen, on this showdown event where every single Friday there's going to be a guest manager, and tonight's guest manager, none other than the Redneck. Oh, I'm sorry, Billy Ray. Billy Ray is your name. What kind of name is, what kind of name is Billy Ray? <laughs> I don't know. You asked Miley's daddy how it is. I have no idea. Well, ladies it and did, gentlemen, there's... pretty good for that one song. Well, look how she ended up, by the way. Oh, look at... Oh, my. There you see. 
the great players right now. Say so, now she would have been just. She'd have been just fine if she stuck to good music. But then she the went next... on to that old uh, pop stuff. You could be the next Miley Cyrus. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, you could. I don't twerk like that. Well, listen, uh, nobody wants to see you twerk, I can guarantee you. But listen, so we know the fans are going to be voting their pick for who will be running things on Friday nights. How confident are you to be the new manager? Oh, I'm going to be the best manager. Of course I'm going to get it. They all going to want to vote for me. So you're confident enough that you're gonna be, people are actually going to be, well, people are going to be voting for you. As confident as I am, Toby Keith's going to be the next oh, best Toby Super Bowl Keith. guest. To what are you talking about? Toby Keith, I think in my estimation, one of the worst country singers out there. Oh, see, that's just un-American right there. Un-American? Toby Keith's the greatest. <laughs> oh, ladies and gentlemen. Did you play some Red Solo? You play some Should've Been a Cowboy? I should've been a cowboy, i tell you that. I'm going to be one. Oh, oh shit. I'm sure you are, by the way. A great cowboy. How do you become a cowboy again? Don't you need those boots? You need your cowboy hat? You need the horse? Well, yeah, you're going to need those, but more important, you're going to need cows. That's well, what course. the ranch is for. Well, uh, you remind me. By the way, you know, I'm sure we can all agree, though. Uh, South Carolina, Florida, New Jersey is better than one state. In, uh, indeed, Infection. better than West Virginia. I'm sure somebody's going to be mad about that. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this matchup is underway, though. The Trash Compactor Supreme. We talked about how important it is for these players to win here tonight. I'm going to eliminate myself so I can spectate all these great players. So there you see the players right now with the pistols in hand. However, it cannot affect anyone because the Win 7 here is taking down these vehicles here tonight. We are joined by Billy Ray, who is managing here tonight. You have two huge announcements. We heard the first one in the early going of this broadcast. You said that the Sword Tournament Championship will be up for grabs. An impromptu Sword Tournament. That's right. Uh That's I'm just not much of one for one-on-one. -on -one. I want a little action going on. Well, you know what? You're right, actually. That's actually a very good point. It was supposed to be a 1v1 as you saw Cookie Man 545 going down. You know, Cookie, I guess that's what you get for being an elite. Nevertheless, though, the 1v1 what? sport no, tournament... No, no, no. What? Elites are great. Well, they are. It's just Spartans are a bit better. Just better in my estimation. Minigun Killer 10 is looking on with Yank and Mike 147. These two are actually standing in the left side of the map, ladies and gentlemen. And again, that's exactly what you want to try to do to try to survive here tonight as Minigun goes to the right side right now. Both men are still alive as we speak. It's Minigun Killer 10 and Yank and Mike 147. Two incredible players, of course. Minigun Killer 10, one of the managers who has a lot of pressure coming in tomorrow night, especially for the Japanese clan. If his TGW representatives group actually loses, you got to understand that we will no longer be seeing Minigun Killer 10. Well, nonetheless, though, Yankee Mike 147, there you see, is looking on. Two minutes and 34 seconds, and so Minigun actually getting infected by the objects. Minigun now getting infected as Clay this Brown 4 has just rejoined here tonight. Yankee Mike 147, though, is the last man standing as we speak. Very impressive tonight. So, again, uh, the redneck joining us here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. As you see, Cookie Man's carcass being shot down by none other than Yankee Mike 147, who I believe, in my estimation, has been dominating this game here tonight. And folks, we are getting set. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, my. Star sailing right there, eating that Banshee. The Banshee crashing down. The Win 7 out, landing hard on his feet. Wait a minute. Oh, no, uses the jetpack here. Bad. Well, let's talk about the strategy, guys. Cookie, Mem, what would you guys do? Um, don't get hit by the vehicle. Right side. I guess so. Don't, especially the soccer balls. Those are annoying. Well, you're right, Cookie. These objects can come out of nowhere, and there you see the Win 7, though, manipulating the style. We understand, oh my, Yankee Mike has been infected. Ladies and gentlemen, that was the game, because there was one player that stand, well, that stood, excuse me, right behind the win. Well, ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, by orders of the guest manager tonight, the redneck Billy Ray will be the Sword Tournament Championship coming up next, ladies and gentlemen. We cannot wait for that one. Also, next week, I cannot wait because next week, it's Andre Senpai is going to be joining us to actually have a huge announcement, whatever he needs to say. Also, a new guest manager. And let's not forget, you, the great fans, will be voting which manager did the best job. And the winner will be the permanent manager here tonight. Well, ladies and gentlemen, yeah, it is a... Well, it, of course, actually. If you have a confident... If you have a confident boost like that, you will indeed win. I do, so I do want to say that the lobby is decent, of course. I cannot wait, though, coming up later on tonight. You have a huge announcement. Huge announcement. I cannot wait for that one. Sword tournament here tonight. 
on Croc's Sword. Oh, actually, wait a minute. It's actually going to be on a new Sword Tournament. I, I think it's going to be on the Sword Tournament Version 2, if I'm not mistaken. So Sword Tournament Version 2 here tonight, ladies and gentlemen, for the Sword Tournament Championship. And again, ladies and gentlemen, we're getting set here tonight. I cannot wait for the... Well, for the matchup here tonight, who's going to become the new champion? We understand it was supposed to be a 1v1 matchup last week. We crowned a number one contender. However, looks like old Billy Ray here crowned, was well, going to be crowning a new Sword Tournament champion tonight. Oh, Sword Tournament he version two, as you see the great lobby right now. The great he's fans are looking on right now, folks. We want to thank everyone for attending here tonight. And also the great fans who, well, watch the content every week. Every You're single welcome. week, of course. And so many great... Yep. Of course. Mem, Cookie, before we get into this matchup, before we dissect this matchup, what do you think you have to do to win? Hide. Run away. Hide, yeah. Yeah, run away. Well, you don't really want to hide, don't though. Don't fight. Because, Be peaceful. But, but you don't want to hide, though, because <laughs> the point of this game is for you to get the most amount of points. If you're hiding, then you're losing all the points. Exactly. It doesn't matter if you're last man standing. Keep in mind that. <laughs> Well, well, ladies last and gentlemen, man standing is the most important man standing. Well, of course, but in this case, though, you need the most amount of points to win to become the sword tournament champion. However, if you really want to make a name but for yourself, and I guess, well, uh, but the person with the most amount of points by the end of the game will be the winner. Uh, um, well, ladies and gentlemen, we still have Billy Ray with us. Billy, I got to ask you another question. So right, you like sir. South Carolina, obviously. Name one thing no, in that state that you Carolina's like. Carolina's better. Well, name one thing that you hey, love man. about oh, that. <laughs> oh, shoot. Um, up until the oh. last year or so, we did have that big old flag hanging off our state house. What flag you know, are you alluding to? the stars and the bars. Uh, wh which show? Oh, wait a minute. You're not talking about the Confederate flag, are you? Oh, my lord. Oh, absolutely. The Confederate? Why, why even choose that flag? Choose the American flag. Can't get more American than that. I fly both. Well, you know, the Confederate flag right. belongs in the dumpster. Look at Cookie Man, though, getting taken down. Of course. Man 5 right now with the energy sword in hand. Both men are locking up here tonight. Man 5 oh my, gets taken down. I believe Yankee Mike, I believe, is winning here tonight. He has two points right now. Could be the new sword tournament champion. Would love to become the champion here tonight. And there you see now Yankee Mike 147 is looking on right in the Minigun Killer 10, if I'm not mistaken. That is Minigun Killer 10. There are a few players left in this game, if I'm not mistaken, as well. Yes, yeah, Star Sailing is still alive. Minigun Killer 10 is alive as well. And it looks like Minigun Killer 10 will not be competing with anybody at this rate. Yankee Mike now looking on. And there you see Yankee Mike 147. And Star Sailing, oh my, going at it. Who's, oh my, Yankee Mike Actually, destroying the Star guy Sailing. The Minigun we're supposed to kill jumped off the edge. I am. He beat him like a possum. Well, thanks. Like a possum? What? What do you beat possum? Hey, you ain't never whomped a, you ain't never whomped a possum with a stick because been getting in the cat food. I actually know, and I have no idea what you're talking about. I really have no idea. I've never. What are you talking about? We don't live in North oh, wait a minute. Carolina, so we wouldn't know. Well, we have no idea, but Yankee Mike One Four Seven has spawned. If I'm not mistaken, I believe Minigun Killer Ten has to go through the teleporter, and there he is. Minigun Killer Ten and Yankee Mike are going at it right now. Who's going to become the Sword Tournament oh, Champion? Oh my! Minigun taking down Yankee Mike, but still. Again, the point I was making, guys, you do not have to be the last man standing to become the Sword Tournament champion. Yankee Mike has three points. He's still Sweet. winning this thing, despite the fact that Minigun Killer 10 was the last man standing. That's the point I'm making. Nonetheless, though, this matchup is on the way for the Sword Tournament championship. We understand. Oh, my. Yankee Mike went for some striking down. And there you see Sub-Zero as well, like Cookie Man. Well, again, a lot of well people ending each other's lives, but still, look at Yankee Mike with four points as we speak, dominating the game. Nuclear RVSB is looking on right now. We talked about how important it is for these players to win here tonight. Let's talk about the strategy. You guys were talking about how important it is to hide. I, in my estimation, it would be, well, kind of smart to actually fake your alliance to someone. Oh, my Fabio, though. Oh, my. Lunging his energy sword. The very highly effective energy sword right into the midsection of that man. Hey, man, Fabio. Who? Yeah, my name's Ben Barrio. All right, boys. Mem sorry, don't Ben Barrio. Don't make me crown a Yankee. I just, I don't know if my heart can take it. Wait, a Yankee? What? Hey, you mean Yankee? Don't make me crown a Yankee. I don't know. I'm a Yankee. Yankees are oh. great, especially our own Yankee Mike One Four Seven, who is winning tonight with four points. Man Five, it was jumping around I know right it. now. Somebody needs to do something. 
What? What's wrong with the Yankees? Yankees are the best. They are. <laughs> oh, seriously, though, ladies. I don't, I don't think we need to go into Redneck what Redneck thinks wrong with the. <laughs> hey, man. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Nuclear RVSB is looking on. These two are going to be going at it. I cannot wait for next week, though, who's going to be the guest manager. Tonight, it was the Redneck Billy Ray. And tomorrow night, though, let's see, the Japanese clan. Are they going to be accepting the challenge? And if they do accept the challenge, Minigun Killer 10's tenure is on the line. Well, nonetheless, Nuclear RVSB now spawning in. These two are going to fight it. At oh, my. Mem 5 -O and Nuclear are going at it. Who's going to be the last man standing? Who's going to gain the point? It looks like it was Mem 5 who actually well, dominated that one, but still winning. did it. Well, still winning it's, this matchup. His name's Mem Bobbio. Not Mem 5 Gosh. Mem 5 Mem 5 -E That's nice, guys. Thanks. <laughs> By the way, I uh, just want to let you know that. The great fan Yankee Mike 147 is actually playing here tonight and also watching the Twitch chat. He wanted to actually give you a message, Billy Ray. The North did win the war. Get over it. Nonetheless, uh, though, many gun killer ten. Over yet. <laughs> uh, the war is over, <laughs> actually. Yeah, the war's been over like it's been it's been for long. Exactly. For Since quite some you time. and all them other presidents. <laughs> <laughs> Cookie Man 545 is looking on right now. And again, still winning this game is Yankee Mike. I was just told by producers that next round will be the oh, final no. round here tonight. If Cookie Man 545 is looking I on the energy source. point this out. Someone yes. in the game is named Cletus. Well, That's yeah, a good Cletus, night, brother. Cletus Brown. <laughs> I guess he has a brown Cletus. Will you stop? Well, there you see, though, all these players right now. The win seven is now, uh, it looks like he's teabagging, having some fun. And it looks like he's going to go after his opponent. No, there's nobody. Oh, wait a minute. Nuclear now. Yeah. Nuclear going against Cookie, but now oh. nuclear. Oh, my. Dang it, Cookie. You so it's now. Uh-oh. So I, I, I just want to. quick scoped me. Oh, gosh. I would love to end the game now. But nuclear right now is four points. Yankee Mike with four. These two are tied, and if Nuclear gains the point, it'll be five, and the next round will be the final round. Who's going to become the Sword Tournament champion? We still have the big announcement later on tonight. Let's not forget that. Here tonight on Halo Reach, a very classic game. Seven years ago, this game came out. The Win 7 Owl is looking on, and his opponent, they're going to be waiting for the teleporter, and oh, there we go. The teleporter, indeed. Nuclear RVSP right now going after the man who's perhaps Nuclear RV. Look at this man go. Nuclear is wasting little time. Both men go down. So it's come down to this. Nuclear with five points. And I would, in, my, in my estimation, I believe that, well, well, I think Yankee Mike is his biggest threat here tonight. Slayer. I'm pretty sure I'm a big threat. Well, every man is a big threat. But in terms of points value, Star Sailing looking on, Sub-Zero. There you see now, skill for the kill here. Minigun Killer 10 is looking on, the energy sword in hand. Look at Enderton. <laughs> is getting teabagged by the dun, win dun, seven. Dun, 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 dun. Spectating Yankee Mike 147, of course, the very proud Yankee. And uh, Mem 5 right now is la landing hard on this platform, getting a. Looks like he's going to go after this man. Both men are going out with the energy sword in hand. How highly effective weapon this could be. And Mem 5 now using that weapon in hand, taking down. Looks like Mem Bono is now with five. Is now with five points. You just love hey, singing that one song, don't you? the most points. Mem Bobbio, you better win. Of course. It's a Mem 5 -o, I will. Don't worry. Mem 5 -o. Don't worry, Cookie Monster. I will. Well, nonetheless, though, this matchup is underway. Man. This is the final round, ladies and gentlemen. Coming up next, though, it will be the huge announcement delivered by Billy Ray. Yankee Mike 147 now. Uh-oh, wait a minute. This is a battle here. I believe it's both men. It's Mem. Oh, my. Yankee Mike 147. He may be looking at a new champion. Look at this. This is very interesting. Yankee Mike 147 versus Mem 5 -o. Both men have six points. The winner of this round will be the sword tournament champion. Yankee Mike 147. A lot of pressure is beginning to build. You know for a fact Yankee Mike has been wanting to become the champion as well as Mem 5 -o. Mem 5 -o and Yankee Mike, how awesome would it be for them to be called champion, especially sword tournament champion. Mem 5 -o is looking dun, on. Dun, 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 Yankee Mike 147 as well. Dun, dun. These two are staring the hole at each other. And I'll tell you again, the winner of this round will be the sword tournament champion. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, my. Yankee Mike wasting a little time as well as Manfado. Both men going at it. Oh, no. Manfado oh wins. Oh, my gosh. Plot twist. <laughs> Plot twist. Manfado wins. Manfado well, is the sword the tournament South champion. Service. Yay. Well, I well, won. <laughs> congratulations to Mem.
who is the sword tournament oh, champion. Congratulations. Hey, the only reason I won was because I wanted to prove that Yankees are better than stupid freaking rednecks. But you well, made Yankees, you made stupid freaking redneck happy. Well, nonetheless, it is now time to give Billy Ray his last announcement tonight. It was great having you here, by the way. But mm -hmm. go ahead. You have a huge announcement. Go right, right. ahead. Don't uh -huh. forget to well, crown man, me. I sure appreciated being here, and I hope to be back sometime soon. But next week, we're going to be doing Rainbow Six Siege. Oh, oh, oh. Yay! Rainbow Six Siege? Woo! And I sure would love to be in here for that some other week. Oh my, so get to I, can't, I can't wait. I cannot wait. Yeah, Rainbow Six Siege next coming Friday. It's going to be awesome. Well, ladies and gentlemen. Adrian that Pramper. Huh? What? Well, nonetheless, though, ladies and gentlemen, here tonight, it is, well, it was Showdown. We want to thank you for joining us here tonight. Who's going to be the guest next week on Friday? What does It's Andre Senpai have to say? And also tomorrow night, catch us tomorrow night for the Saturday game night on Halo. Excuse me, Call of Duty Black Ops 3 will be doing Mike Myers. Nevertheless, though, will the Japanese clan accept? And if it does, Minigun Killers 10, his tenure is on the line. We'll catch you tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen.